Just a couple of days ago, new information was published about the malware used in attacks against the Ukrainian news media and the power uh, industry. And if we look here in this article, at the end there are a couple of IOCs. And one of them is for an, uh, a spreadsheet. So I downloaded this document. And if we take a look at uh, this malware with OLED dump, you can see that indeed it is a spreadsheet with a macro and a, a very large macro uh, and that. So let me select stream seven. and decompress the VBA code and let's have a look okay and here you can see arrays of, uh, of numbers a lot of arrays and if we go at the end here okay so we have up to 768 arrays and then we have a function that will take all those numbers and here in two loops extract the numbers from the arrays and write them to this file vb underscore macro.exe and when this is done it will execute the file and this uh, sub executes automatically when the workbook activate macro runs So it's very likely that the numbers that you find in arrays there in the VBA uh, macro code is uh, an executable. So let's take a look. With my regular search uh, tool, we are going to select the arrays like this so the keyword array followed by characters okay yeah and this enables to us to select all the arrays with the numbers and now we are going to extract those numbers With this uh, tool, numbers to hex, this will select all the numbers in uh, the arrays and convert them to hex, to hexadecimal, like this. So now, for example, I can take that hex code, copy it, and then paste it in a binary editor like the 010 editor and start to analyze it. But I can also pipe it to my other tools. For example, by converting this hex to binary with this uh, tool hex to bin. This will take the hex dump and convert it to binary. So let's pipe this into less and see what we get. Okay. And this is indeed a, a PE file. You can see here MZ, the start of the header. And here this program cannot be run in DOS mode. And then somewhere here, yeah, here we see the PE header. So we can analyze this with PE check. And indeed, we have a uh, PE file that PE check can analyze. And here is the SHA-1 hash of uh, the embedded executable. And if we look at our IOCs here, you can see that for uh, the black energy light dropper, we have exactly the same SHA-1. So we are able to extract 
the executable with uh, these functions. And last thing, you can also take a look at the metadata of uh, this sample like this.